Okay. Uh, let's recap a bit, shall we? Hey, what's going on guys? It's me, JC, and welcome back to my channel once again. And I don't know really how to start this video because it's just been a wild week. It's just been an absolutely crazy, and now that I'm sitting here and taking it all in and, and making this video, my first video back from all this stuff, it's <laughs> it's been an absolutely probably the best week of my entire life. Like, I, I don't know how else to put it. And that sounds really nerdy to say and really stupid to say, but God dang, that, this has just been the best week of my entire life. Like, I I never thought any of this crap would happen, ever. I, I only dreamed of being able to do anything like this of the sort. And I wanted to make this video, and I'm sort of gonna try to power through this video the best I can, but it's really hard to put words to. Uh, but I really want to make this video to explain to you guys just a little bit of the backstory and all this stuff, how all this reveal stuff happened with me and Jason, and also uh, what I got to experience and just how awesome it was. And a couple of things that I wanted to mention straight to you guys. So first off, let's just get this out of the way at the very beginning. Um, tomorrow and through the rest of this week, I'm going to have early gameplay of Zombies Chronicles, which is freaking amazing that I got to do that. This is the first time I've ever been invited to anything ever by any gaming company ever and that just blows my mind like there's so many things that <laughs> like the the trip alone going to LA and being able to record this stuff yeah that's freaking awesome you know I, I love that to death and I, I I'm so thankful that I got to do that and Activision and just all you guys at Treyarch it just I'm so thankful for the opportunity to do that I just want you guys to know that it was something that I'm never gonna forget. Like none of this I'm never gonna forget, just everything. Just thank you so much. I've expressed thank you to you guys multiple times now, but for real, just the whole entire experience of this past week, meeting Jason, uh, being able to fly to Treyarch this weekend and uh, meet all of my YouTube pals that I've known for years now, but never been able to meet ever. It was something that I'm always gonna have close to my heart and it's really, like I said, it's really hard to put words to. It's just really hard to to think of something to say about it on camera because it's just something that I, I sit here now and I think about it and I'm like, did this really happen? Like, did all this really happen? Because when you look at just this channel um, just recently, you know, it's, <laughs> we just hit 100K two weeks ago and I just published the 100K video about a week ago. So like literally, in that time span from just this entire thing with Jason in that two to three day period, we've hit 200,000 subscribers. My entire channel has doubled. So that's another thing as well. Like I'm now making this video for potentially double my audience. And there's probably so many of you guys here that didn't know me before or are just now checking out my channel. And for that, I just say thank you for giving me the chance to just make something for you and for just being here and clicking on this video like that just means the world to me and welcome welcome to the joy and the fun of uh this channel if you can call it joy and fun we've had a lot of crazy moments on this channel but uh the biggest thing that i wanted to say in this video is that i, I just really wanted to express basically what happened to this channel where this channel is going and the stuff that i experienced throughout this whole reveal one of the things i really want any of you new guys to know if you're just checking out the channel for the first time, is that this channel has always been, uh, for the most part, about community, about having fun, about discussing things about zombies. I had a, a series on my channel called Things People Say About Zombies, and essentially what that series was is I would take comments um, from you guys. So like I would basically just read your comments in a video, and then at the very end, I would ask you guys another question to leave comments on, and then I'd take the comments from that video and use that in the next things people say. Like, I give you a subject in every single episode of that series, and it was with my buddy Lex, so like we had like a uh, two-man sort of video series going, it was a lot of fun, and that was my favorite thing to make on this channel. I, I love reading your guys' comments and just getting that discussion going about anything. So like when something new is dropping or something's coming out or some theory comes out about zombies or just anything, it's always been fun to just sit back and not 
give you guys always just my opinion, but let others see your opinions. Because I feel like that's something that doesn't happen a lot in this community, or at least it didn't a lot. Um, people would always make theories and people would see theories from big YouTubers and stuff. But a lot of times you wouldn't see, you wouldn't see those little theories that go unnoticed in the community by just guys in the comment section like you. And I, I love that series to death. Like I love reading stuff and just seeing that discussion going. And I wanted to bring that back this week. So yes, like I was saying, I got flown out to Treyarch this weekend. I will go into more detail about that in this video, but expect every single day this week, a new things people say about each and every single Zombies Chronicles map. And it's been a series that's sort of been stagnated. We didn't really make another Zombies things people say in like six months because there just hasn't been any content to really talk about. But now that there's content here, I really want to bring it back in full force, especially now that we have 200,000 subscribers and there's so many more of you. And I just think it'd be awesome. So I asked on Twitter today uh, about Moon, like basically what would you, uh, what are you excited about in terms of Moon coming back and any questions you have about the remastered Moon map. And if you guys want to go to that you know, tweet and leave a reply, you might have a chance to be in the next things people say. Just want to put that out there because that's what's coming this week. Things people say on every single map. I don't want to give you guys just gameplay on each map because that's, that's what every other guy does. And I don't, I don't want to necessarily do what every single other guy does. Like, I know it's it's awesome, like, check out their videos 100%, but, you know, here I always try to change it up a little bit. I don't want it to be exactly the same. So there's going to be comment reading on every one of these DLC gameplay videos. So you'll have gameplay in the background running that you can look at, but you'll also be getting in your opinions on these maps as the days go by this week. So please check that out tomorrow, I greatly appreciate it. But now let's talk about just in general, all this crap that's happened because there's been a lot of stuff that's happened uh, this past this past week or so. And I just, <laughs> I wanna put it in a video format, just kinda like recapping all this stuff. Let's recap a bit, shall we, like Monty would say. But for real, this entire week, this whole experience has been something that I hardly can, put any words to on how unbelievable it feels and how it, it just it just doesn't feel real like it doesn't feel like this actually happened when i got the word um a while back that i was going to be able to do this with jason and that he was going to come here to my apartment in alabama i mean let's let's make that clear right like this isn't something where they flew us out to LA to do this. No, Jason came to me, to my apartment here. I showed him around my town. I, just that whole idea doesn't seem real at all. And it was just, it was the coolest thing. And I think just throughout this whole experience, um, flying to Treyarch this weekend after all this and being able to talk with the developers, talk with Jason some more, just being in that environment and just seeing the joy and passion from everybody, not only the YouTubers, but the developers as well. The biggest thing that I learned from this entire thing and what I really wanted to get to you guys in this video is that Treyarch is a magical freaking place. For real, I'm not just saying that because of all the stuff that happened, but for real, like they are the, the, the coolest developers ever. Like there's, there's something about it when you walk into the studio and you see the logo and you see all the guys coming out to you just you know, greeting you, meeting you, wanting to know what you think about their game, wanting to know what you think about the remastered maps as you're playing them. I was sitting there playing the maps and just playing the ones that I love and stuff. And I would just sit there and the entire time I was talking to Treyarch guys, I was talking to Activision guys, and they all love it. They all love seeing us play it. They all love seeing what we have to say about it, whether it's good or bad. Like they just love the passion from the community. And I don't think I've, like I've realized that before, like I've gotten that idea before, of course, but I've never felt like 100% full force, like out of nowhere that, you know, Treyarch is always listening. Because there's been some times in the past where people were like, Treyarch, Treyarch and Activision, they don't listen to us ever. Like they're never listening or whatever. They're just, they're, they're just, they're just in it for the money. That's a big thing that always comes up. And yes, they're a business, right? Like, yes, they're making games. Yes, they have to make a profit, so on and so forth. But at the end of the day, they don't sit there and simply put out a game and you know make it in the cycle just for the fact that, oh, hey, we get money. Oh, hey, we, we get a profit out of it. They freaking love this game. They freaking love this community. And I want you guys to understand that because I honestly have never heard of any other developer 
sending the basically the the brilliant mind behind zombies the brilliant mind behind the story of zombies like the biggest guy in in the development of zombies jason blundell co-studio head of treyarch sending him to a small youtuber's channel in alabama this isn't like you know new york or anything this isn't another big city this is small town alabama the fact that this all even happened is a testament to how awesome Treyarch is and how awesome this entire zombies community is and how we're just intertwined. It's the best thing ever. The developers, the community, the YouTubers, you guys, all of us together really make the best community I've ever seen. And I'm not just saying that lightly because I just, I never heard of anything like this happening before. And being, and being in that position to experience that firsthand and to, and to meet Jason and to talk with him, you know, the stuff not on camera, like just meeting him and talking to him just about the creative process behind um, stuff he did in Black Ops 3. Just just being able to talk to a the, the mind behind zombies and just uh, how he loves seeing our opinions about zombies, being able to, to just hear that stuff was, it was life perspective altering. Like it was something that I, 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 I want to like be in a place years from now where I could do that every single day of my life. Like I, I even asked Jason at one point, I was like, do you, do you realize Jason, like, like, do you realize when you walk in the Treyarch door every single day that you work in like one of the coolest places ever? Like, do you, do you ever have that moment where you're like, I work in Treyarch and this is awesome. And, and he's just like every day, every day. That's what he told me. And I'm just, I sit there and I'm like, I don't even know like how to put it into words exactly. Like it's just so magical. Like there, there's just something about it that just really, it's really charming. It's really charming and gravitating. And it just wants, like it makes me want to like, like literally like work at Treyarch one day, like w that kind of thing, right? Like that's that's how that's how awesome this whole experience was. Like it just opened my eyes to the future and like goals that I can strive for and I just, I just, I, I, I'm not gonna take it for granted. Is what I'm trying to say, and I really want you guys to know that Treyarch loves this freaking game. They love it. They didn't have to do any of this. They didn't have to do any remastered maps at all. Everybody's constantly complaining about Mob of the Dead not being in this DLC. They didn't have to do any maps. They didn't have to do one map. They did eight maps with our original characters, making the original storyline available to everybody on one disc. They didn't have to do any of this. And the fact that all this happened, the fact that they revealed it with someone like me who, I mean, I, at the time when they told me that I was gonna be doing this, I didn't even have 100,000 subscribers, guys. Like this was back when I had like 95K subs when I got told this. It's just insane that they they chose me for this opportunity. Like I'm just so thankful. I, I'm just, I'm, I, I don't know how to exactly word it. Like. I just love zombies. I, I've made videos about it for eight years, pretty much. Like I've been playing it for eight years, maybe made videos about it for like six years, and I never got actually good at making videos, I would say, like, you know, good in quotation marks, until really Black Ops 3. I had 5,000 subs when Black Ops 3 started, and this entire game has changed my life. <laughs> it's, just, it's just changed my life. Like this entire community has changed my life. Meeting Lex at this event changed my, like, I, I just loved it. It was so, oh, uh, like, I don't know how to put it. Like, I, I really want you guys to know that I, I'm not taking any of this lightly. I'm gonna be working my absolute hardest this summer to make this the best time on this channel. And it's gonna be hard to beat last summer because last summer is when we did the Grog Krobe Easter egg and all that stuff. So it was a lot of fun last summer as well. But I really wanna try this summer to just really go full force into YouTube now that I'm doing my exams and so on and so forth. And that's another thing I wanna tell you about in this video as well. But I just really want to work as hard as I can to really make this channel the best it can possibly be. And I wanna bring back those discussion videos like things people say to this channel because I feel like that's important. And you're also gonna have those funny videos of Lex, Liam, Azura, all the guys as well because I just want this summer to be an absolute blast and I think it's gonna be freaking awesome. I'm gonna have streams as well. Like I'm just gonna do everything under the sun and I'm just so freaking excited. Like honestly, I am just so excited for this summer. 
it, it was something crazy like this past week and this is sort of what i want to talk about as well um <laughs> i had exams when all this crap was going on so basically like i knew in advance of course that jason was coming uh this past week and i knew that um, we were most likely gonna make a video. Originally when all this stuff was planned, I think me and Jason were going to do a live stream. So it'd just be the same video, but a live stream version of it. And uh, I know a lot of people were just asking me over and over, is it a live stream or is it a video? And it was a video because I had exams. I had final exams this entire last week when all this was happening. And um, of course, Treyarch and Activision, they were freaking amazing and they worked with me to just make it a video, just make it a thing that I could publish so that way you know, I could come home and just upload the video right on time instead of live streaming it because it would just be really hard to do that working around exams on the same days. I literally had a final exam the same day that I did this video with Jason. Like the same day that this video came out, I had a final exam that morning. I had four final exams throughout the entire week when all this crap was happening, uh, when all this recording stuff was happening. And I mean, that alone was crazy. <laughs> it was a crazy time because I'd go to class and I'd just be like, come on, come on. I want to get home. I want to get home. I got to publish this video, you know, and I would get home and then publish this video. And then I published that video Thursday, I think. I think it was Thursday. Yeah, Thursday is when I published it. And in that same day, um, I had to basically go to LA. Like literally that same day, I took a final, published the video, maybe watch, like watched like 30 minutes to an hour of the reaction to it, uh, packed in that same amount of time that I was watching the reaction to that because I just didn't have time to pack the night before. And then I was in a car going to um, Atlanta airport and then going to LA. So like I was gone when this video came out. I was running out the door. Um, and then I got to LA and was able to uh, play the maps with all my buds and experience that whole Treyarch experience. And that in of itself, like I said, we've talked about that a little bit already. And I can't say anything about the maps in this video, guys, because, well, it's still, you know, tomorrow is when we can say stuff. You, you get that, okay, you understand. But all I can say is, they're freaking awesome, right? They're freaking amazing, and you guys will love them. I'll say that. But like I said, just this whole week has been absolutely crazy. I mean, we went from 100,000 subs to 200,000 subs literally in like two days, I feel like. And at one point, I think we were even the, I think number seven in the world uh, for like the top 25 um, like highest growing channels in the last 24 hours when all this stuff was happening. So like there was a time period where my channel was the seventh uh, highest growing channel on YouTube just in terms of how many subs I was getting. And that, like I would just sit there and I'd be like on the plane or whatever going to LA and I'm just sitting there like, I don't know if I can freaking handle this. Like, <laughs> I don't know what to do because I couldn't make videos this weekend about any of this. So I just, I'm like, all right, we're just gonna, we're just gonna wait till I get back and we're gonna make this video to sort of recap everything. Um, because it was something that I really like, I mean, I hope that you guys understand that I'm so freaking ecstatic that there's so many new guys here on the channel watching. I just love you guys to death and I thank you so much for checking out this channel. But just at the time, like I was just freaking out. Like I would just sit here like in the plane, like, you know, you know, when, you know when you shake your leg, like up and down, like back and forth when you're just really nervous. Like I was just on the entire plane ride. I was just going, okay, okay. We're at, we're at 150K now. We're at 160K. Like it was just, it was crazy. It was absolutely crazy. Like just this entire experience, it's been freaking mind blowing. And I I just, I don't know, that's about it. Like it's just been a crazy past couple of weeks. I tried my hardest. I tried my hardest to hint to you guys that some crazy stuff was happening. If you guys look at some of my old videos, let's look at just the 100K video. The entire video was a hype montage. I put hype montage and I do those a lot like with my 100K or 50K specials and stuff like that. Like with my sub specials, I really try to do like these music video specials, you know? And um, I the, the entire video was a, just a hype montage of like old zombie maps. I, I hinted to you guys that it was coming. I didn't make any leaked videos about all this stuff because I just, I don't like leaks anyways. And I just, I just felt like it'd be disgenuous of me to make any videos like especially when I kind of knew that maybe something was happening because Jason was really coming to my apartment 
Uh, but just I kind of stayed silent all this, but I, I hinted to you guys. I hinted. I put little clues here and there. I think I'm, I think I made a comment like on Twitter or in that 100K video at the end or just in the comment section saying uh, like, hey, I'm kind of busy at the moment. It's just been crazy with finals, but the next video is going to be insane. I think I said on Twitter, I was like, I was like, my next video is going to be better than 100K video. And people were like, what? How's it going to be better than 100K video? That video was like, I mean, that video took you hours to put together. It was an awesome montage of stuff. I'm like, this could be better. I wasn't lying. <laughs> it was better in every single way. And I, I just, I don't know, like, I love doing that. I love just kind of looking back and seeing comments from people. And they're like, oh, my God, JC, JC, when you were saying that you had some awesome stuff planned, you weren't lying. I'm like, yeah, dude, I know. It's just been, it's been a crazy couple of weeks. <laughs> it's just been an absolutely crazy couple of weeks. My dad... Uh, my dad just has been telling me over and over just how he can't he couldn't sleep uh, for days when all this was about to come out and, and you know he's like four hours away from me he's back in my hometown right now I'm in Auburn right now still um, but my dad if you guys don't know if you're new here my dad's like a really big meme on this channel we call him dad fire he's awesome he's like the dad of the zombies community pretty much but he just he would be so ecstatic. He's like, "Can I can I tweet something about?" I'm like, "I'm like, not nah, not nah, dad. Hold, hold on, hold on." <laughs> like, "Dad, it's okay. Just just wait a little bit longer and then we can talk about it." And <laughs> he's just he was so happy. Like, it was so cool just seeing not only my dad, but my mom, my stepdad, uh everybody in my life, my sister, just my friends, my friends here in Auburn, like just like DC and Connor, my roommates here. I mean, they met Jason. They met Jason. It was freaking crazy. Like it was hilarious. I think one of the first things Dylan did when Jason was already here this morning and Dylan, I think came back from studying and Dylan just opens my door. And the first thing he says to Jason is not high. He just goes, where's grief? <laughs> it was the funniest thing. Like I was like, I was like, all right, when you settle down in here, like we can't, we can't be already like trying to attack Jason because there's no grief in Black Ops 3. But that's like, that's how it went. It was just such a cool freaking experience. Like, like Jason, Jason was such a cool guy to talk to. Like he was an awesome guy to meet and just being able to get that like sort of like inside look into his brain on like how he goes about things is just so cool and of course guys like he didn't tell me anything like he, he would never tell me anything about like the future or anything like that because he's just never gonna do that like he's just jason so like i a, a lot of the time i wouldn't even bother asking like yo like can you tell me what revelations meant because i know he's not gonna freaking tell me so like usually when i'm talking to him i'm just talking to him about the creative process behind so many things and just the, the just the creative process in the studio as well just talking to all the treyarch guys it was just freaking awesome just hearing that and being in that environment. And it was just really fun to talk to somebody on a level where you both have a extreme high passion for this stuff. Like DC and Connor in my in my apartment right now, like they they played zombies in the past, but they don't have like a extreme high passion like we do, right? So like I will make references all the time with zombies and I will say things like I'll see people raving somewhere like in Auburn, just like partying. And I'll just be like, look, they're raving in the, you know, I'll say crap like that all the time. And they'll just be like, dude, all you make is zombie references. And I'm like, sorry, it's just what's always on my brain. And to be able to sit down and talk with Jason, an adult, like a guy who this is his life too. It's just, it was so cool. Like it was so cool being able to like relate on that level and just talk like your best buds because you love this thing. Like you love this entire thing to death and it was just it was great like i i was extremely nervous about meeting him i was extremely freaking nervous about all of this but once everything started getting underway once i actually met him and i would say about five minutes with just talking with him i was already comfortable because like i said you both love this mode to death you both love zombies to death and being able to just talk about that and you both seen each other too as well right so like you just you both see each other in videos and so on and so forth so it wasn't awkward at all and same with my youtube pals as well like i met lex and it wasn't even awkward i was just like dude there he is that freaking scrub over there it was freaking so funny just meeting like pizza and everybody it was it was great like i just i'm never gonna forget this week guys i'm never gonna forget it it, it was something that like i i just again i just want you guys to know that this would only happen in the zombies community this kind of stuff would only happen in the zombies community. And I don't say that lightly because just this entire thing is a love letter, like Jason said, to the zombies community. They didn't have to make any of this. 
this was all kind of like inspired by the hype and drive of the community i'm sure as well just it all goes hand in hand together and it was just a beautiful thing to see just this past week just to see the positivity all around to not see as much negativity it was just freaking awesome it was absolutely insane so that's pretty much it for the backstory guys i talked for a long time it's gonna be a long video i know but i just wanted to relieve some of my uh, I guess like it's kind of like my uh, the aftermath of all this stuff. I just got home and so I'm like, oh, now I can finally sit down and just whew, tell the story a little bit of what happened. And it was just crazy. It was crazy. It's going to be an amazing summer. It's going to be an amazing summer. Expect videos every single day this week. Every single day about every single Zombies Chronicles map leading up to the launch. And expect... Just, I don't even know what videos I'm gonna make after all these things people say videos come out with each map. And I might have different YouTubers on each one, I'm not entirely sure yet, but Lex said he would help me with them. So hopefully Lex is in them. I'll do them by myself if I have to, uh, but I might get guys like Milo and so on and so forth if they wanna be featured in them as well. So that'll be really cool. Uh, but other than that, just expect <laughs> me doing YouTube full time this summer because now that finals are over, I have all the time in the freaking world. This has been JC. Thank you guys so much for everything because for real, this would not have been possible at all if it wasn't for you guys watching my videos in the first place. Huge thank you to Activision. Huge thank you to Jason and all the guys at Treyarch. It was the best week of my entire life, the best eye-opening experience. And just, I feel like I grew up in so many ways just in this past week. I've never even flown by myself before, guys. Like, I've flown before, but I've never flown by myself before. And that was pretty, like, I was like, do I even know what I'm doing? And then when I did it, I was like, wow, that was super easy. I just feel like I've grown up in so many ways. And I'm just, I'm just so happy that I got this experience. And it's something that I will never, ever lose. Like, I will never forget any of this. And again, just thank you so much just for supporting me and my channel it's just you guys are the best this has been jc and i'll see you guys on the next video have a good one guys